Hello YouTube, this is Dacker13, and in this video I will be showing you all a really cool tweak called Phi Switch. And what it does is it is basically a multitasking switcher, and it's like an alternative to the default one that comes with iOS 4, and I personally like it a little bit better. So to get it, obviously just search for Phi Switch in Cydia, P-H-Y, S-W-I-T-C-H and it should be from the Big Boss repo and this is one dollar and ninety nine cents unfortunately but if you ask me personally I think it's definitely worth it so once you have purchased it you can install it and once you do have it installed on your device you should see a new tab in the settings app or maybe it's been there before it should be called activator and this is basically where you're gonna choose how you want to activate the Phi switcher so as you can see you have all these different activating gestures or whatever you want to call it so you can do the home button you can do a short hold on the home button and you can just touch activate Phi switch but personally I'm going to um, choose the volume buttons and I'm gonna make it so when I press the up volume button and I hold it down it will activate Phi switch so as you can see I already have it activated so if I just press the up volume button and hold it it will activate this application so once you have chosen a gesture or whatever you like to call it, you can try it out. I'm just going to hold down the up volume button and this is what pops up. So it just shows all your current open applications. So I'm just going to exit out and when you have no applications open, it basically says that right there and you can press the home button to exit out of it. So now I'm going to be open up a few applications for demonstration purposes and personally I like this one a little bit better than the default multitasking bar that comes with iOS 4 because I just think this one looks a lot cooler and plus you use it with the volume buttons that's how you change through applications so let's try this one more time I'll hold the volume button and when you press the down volume button it switches applications and you can press the up ones as you can see that looks really cool and if you want to go into an application you just simply touch it and it will go into the application as you can see there now I'm in stocks and I will just try it one more time by holding down the volume button and then I'll just browse through my currently open applications and then you can open one up so that's about it for this video guys if you enjoyed it please don't forget to thumbs up the video by clicking the like button down below also please leave a comment and don't forget to subscribe also, if you haven't already subscribed to my second YouTube channel or followed me on Twitter, please make to make sure to do both of those. I will have two links in the description down below. Once again, guys, thanks for watching the video and see you all later.